Good evening, everyone. Welcome to BTT News. I'm David Hoffman. It has been a year since the highly addictive designer drug D-Pain started gaining popularity. Over the past year, the DEA has worked on finding the producers behind this drug, but have so far been unable to find any suspects. It seems the DEA is unable to stop this drug from spreading over the country, and it won't be long, they believe, before it spreads over the entire planet. The police still believe that the murder of DEA agent Ben Slater is related to d -Pain. Slater was found shot to death in his own driveway. The police have no clue or suspects at this time, and it has been over a year since Slater was murdered. At the time, d -Pain was new on the market, and Slater was the lead investigator of the drug. Police say they have also found two d -Pain drug dealers dead very lately, but also have no suspects on that case. Some believe it is other drug cartels. Others believe someone has taken the law into their own hands and that they're cleaning the streets. Will there be more dead drug dealers or will d -Pain continue to spread over the world? The next few months will show us. David Hoffman, BTT News. Mark Slater. Mark, we have a new lead. Get ready for your next assignment. Okay, Mark, this is a breakthrough, a major step in finding the D-Pain source. A private gang meeting is taking place in Mad Marco's bar tonight. The gang is linked to narcotics. The leader and the bar owner are in on it. They're both D-Pain dealers and convicted criminals. The owner of the bar is Marco Daler, alias Big D. He has a private office in the back of the bar where he sells drugs. The gang leader's name is Lex Ryder. He's also known as the Ink. You should recognize him by the tattoos on his face. Lex has a briefcase with him. We believe the briefcase holds confidential documents of the d -Pain. That briefcase is our only lead in figuring out who's producing d -Pain and who murdered your father, Mark. Your job is to kill both those drug dealers and retrieve the briefcase from Lex. Good luck, Mark.
Hold it. Not getting past here. Private event.
electricity. I'll go check it out. Hey, Rita, turn on the backup generator. What the f your stuff and get the f*** on out of here. With a shaven animation that can help police call out... job done. It's what I do. You just worry about my money. Well, go ahead. What are you waiting for? Got it, Jacob. The d pain documents. Excellent. We're finally getting closer. Come on, let's go inside. Listen up, Mark. According to documents, d pain drug is produced with only one unique device in a specific secret lab somewhere in the city. There's no address, but someone knows more about the location. What do you got? A picture with two names on it. Richard and Catherine Keller. Boys, get out there. See what you can dig up. Let's find something on them. Are you sure we can trust your boys? Of course I'm sure. I've known them for years. They worked in the DEA with me and your dad. Me and my boys are the only ones your father counted on. They are reliable. I've got something else here. It's a picture of the d pain manufacturing device. Take a look at this. Huh, looks like a crappy old computer. Someone's making a hell of a lot of money with it. This device is some kind of new technology, I don't know. Who gives a f***? It produces the drug, so we need to find it, destroy it, and d pain is stopped. So what's next? Well, the DEA is corrupted. We can't rely on them. They haven't made any progress in stopping the D-Pain. We have to see this through on our own. We can save thousands of lives, Mark. But if you keep smoking like that, you'll end up as a dead ex-cop. Huh. Death is always a possibility. 
which is why you need to keep a low profile when going after the Kellers on your next mission. You got that? You just do as I say, Mark, and I promise you, in the end, you'll have your reward, and we'll stop the D-Pain, and you will find your father's killer. You bet your ass I will. Call me when you have the details.